Oh, what is up guys? Gamer Dude back once again, bringing you another game in the South Park series. This time it's the Stick of Truth. Uh, granted, I should have opened with this one because it's the first game, but what are you going to do? Um, I'd already done some Stick of Truth videos on the channel before, but they proved unpopular with only two, maybe three views. So I've decided to delete those videos and do it all over again, given the popularity of the Fractured Butthole. So what we're going to do is we're going to start a new game. And just basically go through it like we've been doing with the Fractured Butthole. It's also taken me this long to get the game reinstalled. Whoever controls the stick controls the universe. Whoever controls the stick controls the universe. Give me that damn stick! <laughs> oh, that, that, that's just a thing I'd love to do. So this is what really got me about the uh, fractured butthole. You couldn't transfer your character over, like you spent all your time and effort creating a character and you couldn't keep it. It was a bit, bit of a waste really. I mean, the, the, there was a lot of potential for the for the second game, and I, th I think they kind of lost out on a lot of that potential by taking out the character transference. But I, I suppose at the time they did it because um, South Park, The Stick of Truth, wasn't available for purchase via disc. It was only downloadable content when you got Fractured Butthole. So, um, that might be why. But th this is what I was saying when I started The Fractured Butthole. The family's really changed in race and well, I think that's color. Everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hon, you all dressed? Hey champ, how do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but son, do you... Remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good, that's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right, get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too. I would love a game explaining this kid's backstory. Like, why doesn't he talk? Why did they have to move to the quiet little mountain town of South Park where it's really not a quiet little mountain town at all? Like, we can all confirm that. <laughs> uh, but, like, a backstory into the kid would be, would be really cool. It'd be really fun. I'd, I'd love to, I'd love to know 
like a more of a backstory on his parents as well because the, 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 there's some scenes in the, in the fractured butthole that are coming up in the walkthrough that are pretty fucked up. Oh, gotta take shit. See that, that that that's a lot better than the crappy mini game from uh, Fractured Butthole. And you can actually run in this one, unlike the new one, where it was just completely removed. Go on outside, sweetie. Was that you? Go look around the neighborhood. Put a cork in it. <laughs> Pigtails. And immediately when you go outside, you bump into the uh, into the other kids of South Park that are doing their own random shenanigans. So when he says my name is Butters the Paladin, I'd be like, the fuck is a paladin? <laughs> now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. And then I go hey, on to say the Wizard King? Are are you kids okay? was foretold by a Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King, but the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Shut up, Mom. Not now. Hang on a minute. We got a goatee. We got a goatee. That's got it going. The evil Cartman storyline, I remember that. Don't talk to her, she's not part of the game. Don't talk to her, she's not part of the game. Polite. Oh my. Is that Spanish? <laughs> Is that Spanish? Oh my. Is that Spanish? <laughs> oh, that's jokes. Is that Spanish? Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. The power of and diabetes. Here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kitty, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kenny wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. Alright then. Just how he seems to be rolling. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. That is the only time to get a friend request from Clyde because he does get banished That's from the space and time. Gave me. My loyalty is as incurable as my diabetes. Be careful, the Rock of Insanity holds mysterious powers. Okay, you're insane now. If you Okay, you're healed. Okay, you're insane now. Okay, you're healed. Okay, you're insane now. Okay, you're healed. Well, that's fun. Princess Kenny. That is really fucked up and creepy. As court paladin, my job is to deliver the Wizard King's justice and his mail. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, 
I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest. But first, please tell us thy name. It really doesn't matter what name you choose, so I'm just going for something. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? No. Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? No. Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. Well, fuck you, fat ass. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. <laughs> I guess we'll never really be friends. <laughs> you look sneaky enough to be a thief. A mage is a, a fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. A mage is like a, you look sneaky enough to be a thief. We'll go with thief. It's the only one in the entire time that I've had this game on PS3 and PS4 that I've never chosen. We welcome to our kingdom, douchebag the thief. Hooray! Now please go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon, and we shall teach you to fight. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? Ah, a lovely purchase. Of course, everything's locked. That is just the lamest thing I have ever seen. You have procured a weapon. Yes. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up that. What? Kick <laughs> that ass, new kid. What I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid. Kick his ass. <laughs> kick his ass. Wait, why can't you kick his ass, fat ass? I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have I'm to wait kick your you turn. in the nuts. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. See, this battling system was a hell of a lot better than the original, than the newer battling system. Oh! Ah! Oh, hell yeah, Clyde's your bitch! All right, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Ah! Oh, shit, dude, I think I see blood! Fucking nice, bro. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bow. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bow. <laughs> protect your bows. Prepare yourself. Yeah. No, no, I said protect. Protect your bow. I was never good at blocking in this one. Critical hit. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already way better than Clyde. All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> pee -pee. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde! Fucking asshole! I'm the king, and I say it's pee pee! <laughs> Douchebag, use your thief ability to make pee -pee. Clyde pay for insulting the king! <laughs> Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag! Now do it one more time! Finish him! What? I was going easy! Take this! Check. Oh, damn it. Too soon. That's <laughs> it. Cry, baby, cry. Cry at my might. <laughs> Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the wreck. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for... Well, here it is. The reason why humans and elves are locked in a never-ending war. The relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The stick of truth. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. For whoever controls the stick, controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long. 
for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the stick of truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week, <laughs> $4 of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! I, lo I love that. Cat Catman charges people to play games with him. It's like, oh yeah, if, if you want to play this with me, I charge nine ninety five and then I tax that nine ninety five for four dollars. Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, humans! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Climb! Guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye aye! Aye aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Douchebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! That can't hurt. Do it, douchebag. Kick these out, asses. No fair. Why does he get to go first? Oh, I have a shit nugget. I can use a shit nugget on him. Have one potion every turn. I asked for five, but this was tough. <laughs> I asked for back, five. Back. Try to block all these attacks. <laughs> well, if this job doesn't work out, at least you've got a future as a training dummy. Come on, get it right. Suck my balls. Oh, damn it. I said block, not get nailed by. Maybe I wasn't clear. Try again. <laughs> okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack. Your enemy on the ground, weak and helpless. Kick the shit out of him. Ah, oh, you kick his helpless ass. Now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King. Feel my wrath. Well, you got to go again. Shit nugget. <laughs> Take that. And one of these. Even the cat's fighting. You can see the cat in the background fighting. You got this, douchebag. In your face! What are you waiting for, douchebag? That guy's just standing there. Go kick his ass. Cartman, you're an asshole. <laughs> oh man, he was totally waiting for you, dude. You can't just hit him like that. You need to try a different tactic to damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrows, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mint. Uh, yeah, bitch, that's what you get for fucking with the Wizard King. Take this! Careful, douchebag. That guy's ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else. I love how it gives you the arrows mid-combat and just expects you to know how to use them immediately. Cartman's a douchebag. He's the douchebag of the year. Let's do this, douchebag. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. Bitch, please. <sighs> Hell yeah, that's how you do it. The other elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. Oh, that's it. Now finish him. Now. I just shoved a wooden sword up his ass. <laughs> Wait, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mist. Oh. Drow elves, fall back. Fall back, I yes. say. Yes, awesome, dude. Take that, you asshole elf. 
Better luck next time. Na 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 na. We still control the universe. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. What? The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde. To guard the stick of fucking truth. <laughs> Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time. What? No. You can't do that. Yeah, I can. You're banished and lost in time and space. Yeah, go home, Clyde. You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. Yeah, <laughs> you can make me a douchebag, but you sure can't fight. Shut up, Scott. Nobody cares what you think. Anyways, we have a bigger problem now. The stick of truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors. Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But oh yes, bad. because we're in the Middle the Ages and have cell phones. Rotting drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go! And send my warriors here! Fighters, go with him. Guess I'm minding the shop now. You need any weapons or armor? Here's what we're selling today. Clyde's helmet. After Clyde was banished from space and time, all that remained was his helmet. <laughs> oh man, you gotta be super high level for most of this stuff. A Jewish staff. A nice purchase. Oh, we'll replace that crappy wooden sword straight out. For a katana sword! <laughs> oh yeah, because a, a kid with a sword is so, so good. So how can the parents let the kids actually run around with weapons? Spanish. I still can't get over that. It's still hilarious. Uh, this is the king's room. I don't think we're supposed to be in here. What exactly are you looking for? Mr. T poster on the wall. What's Butter's house key doing in here? Oh, they're the uh, semen thingy, whatever they are. Awesome! Out. There's his coon costume, which, in a sense, was actually a uh, sort of reference to the next game. There's Faith Plus One album. So yeah, there's there's a lot of references in this game, and a lot of the references are actually better in this game than in the second. And yes, on the radio there, that was Cartman singing from a previous episode. Oh, look at that! Cocaine. You got a bong, you got a vibrator. You got some lube. This is where the magic happens. Last week, Cartman's mom was here with a few men having a whole lot of magic. She was doing hand magic and butt magic. Oh, I bet she was. I bet she was butters. I bet she was. <laughs> hand magic and butt magic. This <laughs> oh is where Cartman magic. Smells like the wizard is brewing some potion in here. Some wizard stew. Oh, looks like he forgot to flush the stew. <laughs> looks like he forgot to flush the stew. If it splashes, it means you get a free wish. Don't ask me why in this game they allowed you to put the shower on. It's just pointless. You can't you can't really do anything with it. We aren't allowed to go into the street. But it's such an open world, our parents don't want us getting hurt. But those are holy items from the Orient. Legend has it that he who can collect enough will be rewarded. Uh, so, um, I am also doing 
South Park The Stick of Truth at request. Uh, and due to the fact that Fractured Butthole was so popular. The Wizard King says I'm too ginger to be one of the humans, but Paladin Butters lets me be his... Behold, the residence of Butters the Merciful. Um, as I said, granted I probably should have done this one first, but it was it was already up on the channel, it just didn't receive any views at all, because I did it very early days, when the channel was still in its infancy. You Facebook me right away if Butters does something he should be grounded Butters really is a very sweet boy. I hope you'll treat him as you would. So I've decided to delete the original videos and just do Welcome it again. To my room. Those are my minions. They help me punish society. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Boobs. Lots of references in here to Butter's past episodes. Isn't isn't that a cheesing thing on his shelf there from when they were cheesing from the cats? I, I don't know. Oh, and there's the um, Deus of Del Montecilia. I remember that one. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but yeah, I remember it was when they were playing Mexican and he actually did go to Mexico and they thought he was a Mexican trying to immigrate. Yeah. Don't worry, I'm just looting your house, butters. <clears throat> so I'm trying to get most of the main stuff out of the way first. Just because, uh, again, we are limited for time. Stop giving me shit I can't use. Uh, see, the, this gameplay, it isn't only a um, playthrough. It's also a walkthrough. So, uh, to anything I'm getting in this that you may not have got in yours, if you've played it, uh, then just go ahead and follow it through. And this is the fast travel system I was talking about that's a lot better than the fast pass one. Because, yeah, Timmy on his um, sort of electric scooter thingy, and then Jimmy with his crutches. These lands hold many dangers, new hmm. kid. Yeah, you moved to the wrong realm. Nice hair, douchebag. No, fuck you. Die, asshole. Wait, why do you get to go first? Take that. You're hurt. This looks like a job for Paladin Butter. There you go, Al. Huh, that beat. I better wait a turn before that's I do any more. That's why it was so much better in this with the combat system. Most, mostly because um, it's easier to move around. The menu, the quick menu to do things is is a lot Come better. On. Damn. I don't. I don't think I had a choice. I don't think I could have dodged those. Make sure you always carry a few potions. Just don't get grounded for waiting in Papa Joe's pantry like I did. Do. <laughs> don't get grounded. Uh, but as you always get grounded. <laughs> oh my God! That power is awesome. No, I, I want to unlock Professor Chaos. I don't think so. Nice try, asshole. 
That's not fair. Bonus holy damage. Leave butters alone! I need to remember how to block things. No, but is just supposed to say all oh, hamburgers. I'll be watching. That's butt Brady. Wait. Will this snow ever melt? I don't know. I think you have a nice nose. I'd worry more about your hair if I was you. What's wrong with my hair? Oh, hello. Are you interested in some rhinoplasty? Look at that. The hassle of 175 bucks. There's actually an achievement in the game for finishing the game with David Hasselhoff's face. Not sure why Ubisoft went with that, but okay, I guess that's a thing. You must be in our little Bradley's class. I. Everyone thinks their child is special, but I. Oh, the shut best up. The way to get to Canada is north. I'd love to chat, but you're unpopular. Mr. Slave's package. That is clearly a giant dildo. Huh. So I've, pl I've played through this one a lot more than I've played through the fractured butthole, so I know what I'm doing through this one. That I know where I can go, and I know where I can't go. We must get back to the rescue man for a piece on youth narcissism. I can't wait to read about me. Vote or die, Some motherfucker. This here is the marketplace. This is where heroes can come for adventure. Shut up. Give it back. Give it back. Why don't you make us? That's my Justin Bieber toy. Not anymore. <laughs> oh not. god, Justin Bieber oh, toy. Did baby lose her toy. Who is this? Be a kid if you know it's good for you. Uh. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's beat up some girls. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't for the record I don't agree with this. Can't touch this. Can't touch this. So what do you guys think of the, the stick of truth as opposed to the fractured butthole? <clears throat> do you think it's uh, a lot better than the fractured butthole? Uh, do you agree with me that the combat system is a lot better than the fractured butthole? Uh, because I, the combat system in this is just so much easier compared to the fractured butthole. Oh, it vibrates. Hey kid, 
Maybe you can help us with something. All these homeless people in South Park are making us look like a cold and heartless town. If you could go and beat the crap out of all the bums and vagrants, <laughs> they'll leave town, and it'll restore South Park's reputation as a compassionate community. You gotta get every single one of those bastards, okay? Chop chop! Unfortunately, no California love song will be sang at this point when you get rid of the homeless people. If anyone knows the episodes, you'll know what I'm talking about, where Cartman and the lads get rid of the homeless people. I think it's it's meant to be a 28 days later reference. If you refer um, Jimbo will wait for all the homeless are going around like, change, spare some change. And uh, the, the kids come up with this bizarre plan to get rid of them, which in, involves them singing California Love on a bus, taking them to California. Yeah. Hilarious episode, but unfortunately it's not a reference to that particular episode. Oh, what sad times these are when the nation's youth run around in dungeon clothes playing the games of Satan. Young man, if you really want power, there's only one thing you must do. Find Jesus. Find him, and when you do, return to me. You know you can die from a titty twister? Out of my way. <laughs> Thanks for the random information there, Butters. And you can die from a titty twister. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, Jesus is in here. Tee hee hee hee. You found me. Tee hee hee. Next time finding me won't be so easy. <laughs> you found Jesus. That is also an achievement as well, if you find Jesus while playing as a Jew. <clears throat> Naturally, of course, I do have that trophy. What are you looking at, pussy? Goodbye, Demon Elves. I got beat up one time over there by that tree. Great information there, Butters, as always. <laughs> So I, I, I really do prefer this game to the uh, Fractured Butthole. I mean, don't get me wrong, Fractured Butthole it is a good game. It's it's great that they continued the franchise. But um, other than that, I, I really don't think they thought about it. Because we waited so long for the Fractured Butthole after so many postponements and rejiggers and having it sent back to editing rooms. Uh, for censorship and whatnot, as we've all probably seen in most of the most of the stuff, it is actually censored. Unlike this, it's like if they don't censor that in this game, why the fuck would they censor someone getting anally probed? I mean, they've shown worse stuff in the in the in the TV series. There was worse stuff in the South Park movie. I've 
Ah. This is Kevin the Star Trek nut. Well done. The galaxy is in your debt. Let it be known that I have been and will always be your friend on Facebook. Uh, PS Girls 7815, thanks for the subscribe. Haven't even uploaded this video yet, and I'm giving a shout out, so thank you for subscribing. So I've probably got time to do one more thing and then I'm going to have to call it for this video. So let me know if you want the stick of truth to continue with the fractured butthole. The uh, fractured butthole has been rather popular, that's why I, I have continued it. And that's why I've started this up. Looking for Craig? Well he can't play, he's in detention. Something about flipping off the principal. We better get to the other guys first. <laughs> flipping off the principal. That, that is Craig's special power, just flipping people off. These kids are eight years old, man. This is a really bad influence. Are you new? Hey, that means you don't know anything about me, huh? Well, another reference to the next game, you can see the uh, human mosquito outfit in the back there. Sure is a lot of work. I'm actually faster at Facebook messaging than I am at speaking. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh, that's jokes. Oh, you want some of this? Sorry, but we can't be friends until you have more friends. Okay, so we'll, uh, we'll have time to check this building, Stop and then I have to call it for this video, I'm afraid, guys. Okay, this is a stick-up. Put all the money in the bag, I'll fucking kill each and every one of you. Oh, hey, all right, Benny. How's it going? Just showing the new kid around. Hi, Butters. Good to see you too, Butters. Thanks for checking in. <laughs> I love this. This is a reference to a previous episode. Welcome to the Bank of South Park. Would you like to invest money with us today? Yes, I would. Thank you. Wise move, young man, and a bold first step towards your financial future. We'll just take that and it's gone. And significant leverage using computer-assisted high-frequency trading and index fund rebalancing to buy ahead of certain stock movements, and it's gone. <laughs> and it's gone. <laughs> oh man, that's jokes. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thanks for your love and support over the last few weeks while I've been on this 90-day streaming ban content will be continuing in this 90 day streaming ban stay tuned this week for another just the facts with gamer dude have a really special episode in store for y'all hope you enjoy it that popular that series has also proved popular that's why i have continued it uh, as i said granted i get that i should have done this game first before fretted butthole but it has already been on the channel before. I'm not sure if anyone knew I'd done it before. It was way, way back in some of my older videos. Uh, so what I'm going to do is delete those videos and just continue on with this walkthrough. Uh, hopefully, because these games are quite long, I should be able to resume live streaming them when I am able to live stream again. So yeah, that's it guys. Once again, thank you so much. Shout out to all subscribers, old and new. Appreciate the love and support. This has been Gamer Dude. Happy gaming. And I will catch you all real soon.